There was no hiding the relief on the face of Bodie Risby Jones as prosecutors paraded him for the media for one final time. Even though he struck a compensation deal with a man he injured late last month, it was only this week that national authorities in Jakarta signed off on it, paving the way for his release. I am very, very relieved and happy and I'm very grateful too that I can go home. I made a fool of myself and it was shown publicly worldwide and yeah, respect the laws. This was a surfing trip that went terribly wrong for the young Queenslander. Bodie Risby Jones has said that he had a shot of vodka at his hotel and then went night swimming in his underwear before locals angrily confronted him. Police say he was drunk, naked and running around attacking people. Either way, the serious injury he caused to a local fisherman, combined with his admission of drinking in an area where alcohol is strictly prohibited, saw him facing up to five years in jail, but a $25,000 compensation payment to the family of the victim averted prosecution. This case shows that even though a lot of Australians tangle with the law in Bali, things can be very different in other parts of Indonesia, particularly Aceh. And getting out of there isn't easy. Overnight, Bodhi Risby Jones got on a 14-hour ferry to another city. He now needs to take a couple of flights to get home to Australia. No doubt he'll be very relieved to finally arrive back in Queensland.